Welcome to our presentation. I'm Nguyen. I'm Amel. Uh, we're the M&M reporters with our motto. We're not candy, but, but we're sweet. Today, uh, today we're going to discuss about three biggest green issues that all have to face, which is deforestation, water pollution, and the most well-known phenomenon, global warming. Well, we have a mind map to better illustrate our problems mentioned above. Uh, have you ever experienced the beauty of the forest? Have you ever walked into a peaceful garden or park to escape from everyday troubles? Well, imagine the scene if all the malnutrition landscape disappear and all trees are cut down, leaving nothing but dust and polluted air. Well, this is a nightmare to all of us, and this nightmare will come true in only 15 years if we continue destroying and do nothing about devastation now. Do you know that, uh, according to scientific data, approximately there are 32,000 hectares of rainforest disappear in a day, which means that every year there are 12 million hectares of rainforest <laughs> vanishing. To make it worse, um, an area as large as a football field uh, is stripped of rainforest in every second of every minute. And so what exactly is deforestation? Well, to simplify the definition, deforestation is the process of cutting and burning trees. There are many factors contributing to the occurrence of deforestation. The first cause is forest fire which not only lessens the amount of trees but also produces more carbon dioxide and worsens the phenomenon of global warming. Population also, population also accounts for the deforestation to a certain degree. As human population increases, the need for living place as consequently also increases. Foods are also need for wood and paper products. Over exploitation as well as mining and infrastructure reduces the place where tree can grow and farming uh, and cattle ranching it which takes a lot of place uh, forest um, can also one possible cause of deforestation. Moreover, in many countries illegal logging happens frequently, uh, not only causing the consequences of economy but also the loss of many valuable trees. Due to the fact that forests play an important role in maintaining lives on Earth, uh, deforestation may considerably affect uh, the ecosystem in general and human beings in particular. And the first effect is uh, flooding. Um, since trees reduce the um, speed of watch, uh, water flowing, uh, normal trees mean water will flow freely at a high speed and therefore causes soil erosion. Furthermore, rainforests create and adjust their own weather, including the patterns of precipitation. Uh, thus, without rainforests, the patterns of precipitation will change and may cause flooding. The entire food chain may be uh, influenced, and uh, most serious of all, deforestation leads to global warming, as there are no more trees to uh, absorb carbon dioxide. This severe effect leads us to an important question. So, what can we do to to prevent deforestation. There are basically four ways of re get rid of this problem. First is to replace. We should replace tissue with washable handkerchief, plastic plates, and cup with normal dishware, wipes with washcloth and paper towels with dish towels. Another conventional way is to plant trees. In class, you can also propose the idea of rewarding the cleanest classmates. That way, your class will have more motivation to go green. Last but not least, an economical way of saving the forest is to borrow books from other people instead of buying. In everyday life, we need washer to quench our thirst, to water our land and crop, and to keep animals and plants in our home alive. Uh, however, such things may stop since our planet Earth is facing uh, a problem, which is um, water pollution. Water pollution occurs when a body of water is adversely affected due to the addition of large amounts of material to the water. Two types of water pollution exist, point source and non point source. Point sources of pollution occur when harmful substances are emitted directly into a body of water. On the other hand, a non point source delivers pollutants indirectly through environmental changes and is much more difficult to control. Pollution arises from non point sources accounts for a majority of the contaminants in trees and lakes. 
The possible causes of water pollution may be global warming, air pollution, industrial water radioactive waste, and un underground storage leakage and eutrophication, and affected by water pollution and health, environment, and economy. Uh, in many developing countries, um, uh, water polluted by lead and oil pollutants uh, cause severe diseases such as brain, ca uh, brain damage, cancer, or even direct death. As for the environment, um, the water pollution influences uh, marine life and may cause um, uh, increasing amount of algae, uh, preventing photosynthesis, and uh, even cause acid rain or decreased oxygen. The countries wanting to prevent water pollution also have to lose a lot of money on creating biological filters, chemical additives, and sand filters. But prevention is still cheaper than cleaning up the water pollution that had already occurred. So, to stop water pollution from becoming worse, we should be responsible to our planet. First, don't litter. Let's be an within your risk. All, only use organic food. Say no to plastic bags and avoid marine transportation such as ships or yachts because they emit oil into the ocean. And the last green issue we are going to discuss today is a, a well-known phenomenon uh, that has been mentioned in many documents and uh, famous movies such as An Inconvenient Truth by Anne Gore and it is global warming. The Earth's climate ch naturally changes over long term periods swinging from long ice age to shorter, warmer periods. However, recently, scientific data suggests that the Earth is warming quickly rather than naturally and slowly. This is global warming. It is, it is caused by greenhouse gases, including carbon dioxide, ozone, methane, and water vapor produced from human activities. Maybe some of you are wondering why we're exaggerating the problem of global warming. Because uh, Earth is only hotter a few degrees, and maybe a tropical climate would be nice, and uh, there are no more uh, cold days, only a warmer and sunny days. But uh, in a ma as a matter of fact, its consequences are very disastrous. First, high uh, temperature means widening the spread of diseases because uh, bacteria can find um, the suitable conditions to reproduce. Global warming changes the pattern of weather, leading to some natural disasters in a high level, like hurricanes, drought, and heat waves. Like um, water pollution, global warming can also result in economic consequences. This is the fact that it costs a lot of money to resolve the problems to which the phenomenon leads. Worse than that, global warming causes polar ice to melt, gradually raising sea levels, making ecosystems out of balance, and endangering animals. Well, luckily, there still remains a huge amount of solutions to get rid of global warming, which students uh, can conduct easily. First, no, we uh, pro pro suggest a solution. First, is only use economical life books. Second, avoid packaging when you're shopping. Third, wash both wisely. Use an appropriate amount of water and air dry your clothes. And fourth, the most important is three R: reduce, reuse, and recycle. To reduce, you should adjust the thermostat properly, less driving, more cold water instead of hot water, and turn off all the unused devices. To reuse, you should use clothes bags instead of plastic bags, rechargeable bags and rechargeable batteries, and recycle. Only use recyclable products. And uh, the fifth way is uh, to use sweaters instead of heater because it's uh, most economical and uh, uh, environment friendly. And you should also go vegetarian once in a week because cattle produce a lot of methane gas which is not good for our planet. And you should definitely say no to cigarettes because it's uh, healthier for you and also have the environment. You should also try grass food with leaves instead of plastic bags because you'll be surprised to see how more delicious it tastes. In summary, green issues, especially the three we have mentioned, the both are destructive and thus dangerous to human beings. However, we think that if we try our best, then we can save our beautiful and natural planet. Keep this in mind. A little goes a long way. So do whatever you can and and remember we are M and M reporters and we, we love ourselves. Thank you for listening. Bye. Bye.